Hey everyone, this is a, a quick add-on to the, the video that I intend putting out. Only I was in a card shop today and I saw this Christmas card and I thought it would be the perfect Christmas card for a J-Dub. What do you think? Look, there you are. Because that's how poor kids are. Some of them are going to have to spend Christmas Day. whoop de do. So there you go. And how could they be offended? Okay, on to the on to the real vid. Bye. Hello everyone, how you doing? Thanks for popping by. Great to see ya. Um, well, I can't see you. And you can't see me, but that's what they say on YouTube, I think. I don't know. So I had done a couple of videos at least on buying presents for J-Dubs, okay? Because it's always a problem every Christmas. What do you buy the J-Dub in your life? One of the products particularly had tickled one of the viewers, Sharonka. She was saving up, I think, for one of these in every colour. Great leatherette, leatherette, normal price $79.99, but you can get them from Ministry Ideas for $79.99. And they had a very, very important customer announcement. That it look, it does not include the Yahweh, however you want to say it, Hebrew Tetragrammaton. It does not. You wouldn't know. I, I, that'd be a bit weird if it did. But and it doesn't improve. It, it doesn't include a pyramid. No pyramid. No Masonic symbols. Not good. But I didn't think. I mean, it's called Charles Taze, but it's not very Charles Taze-y, is it? So here it is. I made it more Charles Taze-y for you. There you go. Do you like that? How's about that? Hmm? So you get you get a full attached Charles Tay's beard. Fantastic. I mean, you can't as a bloke have a beard as a J Dub. Not especially not one sort of hairy wary like that. It's a bit Father Christmassy as well. So um you can't you're not allowed one then, but your bag could have one, couldn't it? So there you are. I hope, and that should add some money to it as well. I'm going to could add another fifty dollars for that, really. So I hope I hope you like that. And uh, Ministry Ideas, you can have that idea for free. I'm, I'm not, you know, I'm not mean. So I thought I'd I thought I'd make it more Charles Taze by referring to his divorce. So I'll I'll put a link to this. You can go into the details of what was said through the divorce, and it was a baddie. And he, well, any way you slice it, okay. He was not good to his wife. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Well, there have been all this scandal with Rose, who lived with them since she was at least 13. And, oh, dear. And here we've got here. The context is unknown. But R Rose also told Maria, and you can actually see the court documents in this, that Chucky had stated to us that they're being naughty. That's Charles. They're naughty boys. He said... This is very famous. This, I am like a jellyfish. Oh, that's nice. I'm like a jellyfish. I float around here and there. I touch this one and that one. Ew. And if she responds, ew, I take her to me. Ew. And if not, ew, I float onto others. Ew. Rose also told Maria that Charles had told her that a man's heart is so big that he can love a dozen women, but a woman's heart is so small that she can love but one man. So in honour of that, I couldn't find a picture of a jellyfish that I could know how to apply. So um, you have to make do with like an octopus thing, okay, or is it a squid thing? I can't remember what the difference is, but there we have, but I thought that the words were very, um, very pertinent. So many feels. So there you have it. Complete options. For your Charles Taze men's preaching bag. No, don't thank me, don't thank me. It's the least I could do. Bye.